What do you have for me today? Today? Okay. This is, no, it's going to look ugly when I open it, but you're going to make it look beautiful. Okay. The reason I bought it is because I like the material. So this dress, this, this is, is what we're doing today. It's hideous right now. Okay, it's hideous right now. <laughs> you're going to make it magic. Okay. 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 I want you to bring it to life for me. Okay. okay. Bring it to life. Yes. Oh my god, okay, got it. Yeah, it's so. No, it does nothing for you. But can you. I need you to vision it with me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Like this. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we can make that happen. And then these, I want you to make them umbrella. Um, I call them umbrella arms. Uh huh. You know when you bring the bottom together? I wish I had a hair Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You want to put a band and then, yeah, and like. Then you, like it'll, Look, I'm gonna show you because I, I. Yeah, you wanna gather it. Yeah. And yeah. Real cute. Yeah. And it kind of goes like. Right, that. right, right, right. Tell, yeah. Can you see it? Can you yeah. feel where I'm going? Yeah, yeah, yeah. With it? yeah, yeah, yeah. I may have to add darts like here and here. Okay. Okay. And um, what do you what do we want to do here? I feel like that would almost be sexier, like this. Here, just to let's make see. It simple in the front, like just this is sexy. This goes with the whole look, I think, that we're going for. Okay, so we'll take that off. Okay, so we'll take it off. So let me get the scissors. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna, we're gonna we slim trans- this down. Okay. okay. So you see, we placed our pins here. Okay, so we're gonna send this all the way down. I wanna see it from the back. Okay, and then we're gonna put a, a dart here to shape this right here over the butt. And then, I like the way it, it fits right here under the seat. This guy is really sharp. We took and we marked how the hips are going to fit in the waist on the front and we marked it here on the back and then we'll do, we'll double this and cut it evenly on one side and then double this one and cut it on even on that side and then here for the dart in the back we made ourselves a note that the back dart is going to be eight and a half inches down and it's going to come in five eighths of an inch and then we're going to blend this back into this seam, you won't even be able to tell. And then here in the front, we had darts here. I took those out, and those are going to be seven inches down, one inch take in, and we're going to ease it back into this underbust. Okay, part. next step is we've already pinned our, this is our center front here, and we folded it and doubled it so it's even on both sides. The chalk marks are a little light here, but now, so from here to here is seven inches, as you can see. And now we're going to go in and find the center of that dart. And we're going to come down to seven inches. And here, we're going to curve this a little bit. Okay. Now, we're going to cut this out. First step is to put this here. You see I'm just following this line here and it's going to go off to nothing. Okay, cut so much off and then we're going to tie this like this because there's not a way that you can back stitch on a serger. So the way you lock it, you just take your serge, you do that, you take a pin, you put it in the knot right here, and then you just pull straight down on it, and that locks your serge. It's locked. It's not going anywhere. See that center back dart? Okay. It comes right to the top of 
the buttocks and then what you're going to do is just press this at a curve like that because the, the butt is curved or the boote okay okay so now we got our our armbands cut now what we're going to do we're going to put our first stitch in so that we can gather our sleeves up because this is a bell sleeve so first we're going to give ourselves a reinforcement stitch and then we're going to lengthen our stitch up to number five make sure your tension is really loose and then we're going to stitch around once okay so now we're adding our second row of stitches so we're going to stitch this all the way around and then after we're done we're going to pull them together and that's going to give us the perfect gather And now we're going to start pulling this and then that's going to give us the perfect gather around the sleeve. See by making that tension, by making the stitch really long, by keeping your stitch really long and having your tension really loose, you're able to keep the threads where they just slide. The fabric just slides over the threads. So after you finish doing your pulling, then you tie this off on the end right here and then it gives you the perfect amount of gathering. And now we're going to take this, turn it inside out and put it on and then we're going to stitch around it and then serge it. Okay so now that I've got my the band on here and the gathers, you see how the double line keeps this flat and then you stitch on the top line. And that way when you turn it inside out it's going to make those gathers look like they're like perfect. When you turn it inside out, voila! You see what I'm saying? That's your sleeve. Boom. This is before. Fabulous. Wow. Now, do you love it now? I love it. Okay, it looks great. Yeah, I just want to see how the sleeves came out. They came out really nice. Yeah, they look great. And then I like the way the seam came out in the back, like right here mm -hmm. on the side. Wow. Yeah, and don't you like the way this dart? Like hits you right at the top here. Uh -huh. yeah. Okay. I love it. It came out great. Of course. Okay. Always.